This is what I normally do. If you are at home, don't try to do it with the kitchen knife, all right? I know, I saw one gentleman a couple of weeks ago, he told me, oh, I do this at home with the chicken knife. Okay, it's your own risk. Now, you cannot do savor with any kind of bottle of champagne. It has to be Metro de Champenois or Champagne region. Let's say you go to the supermarket and you buy ten bottle, bottle, ten dollars bottle of sparkling wine. <laughs> Don't even try. <laughs> it's very dangerous, and you know why? Because the weight, the pressure, is very high. Even if it's a low quality of sparkling wine, you know, it's very high. And if you do it with any kind of bottle, it can explode and you can be injured. All right. So what I'm going to do next is. <laughs> There we go. First of all, I'm going to remove the fork. Okay, then, also. <laughs> they love me, you know. Here we go. So I'm going to remove the foil, okay? Right, I remove the tire foil and I remove the seal. Now, it's very important. The champagne has to be very, very cold. How do I know that it's very, very cold? Because the corks remain. If the champagne will be not that very cold, the, already the cork will be not there anymore. <laughs> okay, now you have to look for the lines. There is the, each bottle has lines, okay? I don't have my glasses, but I'm just trying to use right. my here glasses. We go. No, no, it's fine. So, I'm going to do it here in the back. All right? Don't no, trust me, I'm still, I'm going to do it. So, at the count of three, all right? Okay. One, two. No, no. All right, here we go. Three. Okay, one more time. One, one two, two, 